13 Loves Pets, sponsored by My Auto Import Center. One West Michigan family's Christmas was dampened by the loss of their pet. That pet, a cockatiel, which embarked on an epic journey to find its way back home. 13 on your side, Elena Holland explains. We kind of just like clicked right away. She loves just sitting on my shoulder like this. Brendan Franklin has a special bond with his pet cockatiel named Odin. Odin. But on Christmas Day, as he returned to his home in Walker with Odin. Christmas was good at first and then it just ended up being like heartbreaking. She flew out of Brendan's pocket and got caught in the wind. My heart dropped. It was windy and like it looked like she was trying to fly back down to me. For hours, Brendan and his sister Caitlin searched and searched and searched the neighborhood for Odin. Jumping fences, looking in trees, going through bushes all over the place. Christmas Day passed, as did New Year's, with no sign of Odin. We're starting to lose hope, but I kept thinking, oh, there's got to be a way, some kind of closure. But then a phone call from Lansing, where someone had found Odin. She had somehow made that roughly 75-mile journey in the middle of a Michigan winter. A bird rescue in Lansing said a family found a cockatiel just like Odin in Weberville. Caitlin and Brendan compared photos, looked closely at the feather markings, and the rescue owner said the bird fit Odin's description and behavior. Monday night, they went to pick her up, and they felt right away they found their bird. Right when my brother walked in the room, you could tell it was the sweetest thing because Odin hadn't chirped or anything for this woman that was caring for her. But right when she saw my brother, she just went berserk. Somewhere along her journey, Odin may have been attacked by an owl or hawk because her head feathers were all plucked out and she has a broken toe. There's no way to explain what happened. She's nine years old and she made it through the winter nights. She was out in the cold for, we think, six days. I think that's when the family found her and attacked and then brought back to us. Now Odin is getting lots of special treats and will have a visit to the vet soon. And Brendan is happy to have his friend back home once again. It just shows how special of a bird she is and it just shows the um, commitment that our family has to showing love and care for, you know, people that are involved in our family. Elena Holland. Even if they're birds. Even if they're birds, <laughs> yes. 13 on your side.